In Python, the file is categorized as either test or binary. Pender allows us to work with test and binary files such as Excel and CSV. Functions like the with CSV with Excel methods enable us to work with files effectively under a data frame instance. As mentioned, Pandor is mainly used for machine learning in the form of data frames. Once we use uh, Pandor functions to extract data from our test file or binary files, the data will be formed as a data frame, and Pandors further allow us to perform various data manipulation operations. A large number of methods in Pandors can help us to compute the descriptive statistics and other related operations in data frame. And let us go through the most commonly used functions in this video. So here, let's load the database first, and then we print out uh, the first five rows for you to understand, uh, for you to understand the database you know, data set that we have. Here, this is the um, some stock information, and you can see that there's a uh, there are few um, server and end right here. So we are going to let's remove it first. Uh, DF dot job and a and uh, access. We just uh, want to remove the row that contains an a and make sure that in place is equals to true. What we have right now. Okay, now um, the NA has been gone and then has been removed it. And so we have for every row, we have the uh, stock name as the, uh, which is the um, index. And then we have around uh, a circle, I guess that should be more than eight columns um, for the stock information, and we have the stock price and so and so. So let's see what we could uh, calculate uh, with the um, descriptive uh, uh, statistics. So say for example, we just would like to compute the um, statistical information for the first row. Um, just would like to have the um, number of counts, uh, number of counts in the first row. See what we what we have. So we have our, for the first row, we have a uh, fifty count, and then we can also use the sum function to sum up the first row. I mean, sum up the stock price for each of the elements. And you can see the results right here. And we can also calculate the mean. Calculate the mean of the first column. And this is the result. We can also calculate the median. And this is the median price of the uh, first row. And we can also calculate the standard deviations for the first row. That is the stock price of this um, of this first row, the standard deviation. And we can also calculate the minimum value or return the minimum value of the, the first row. Uh, this is 2.36. And similarly, we can return the maximum value in the first row. Uh, we can also make the whole column to be absolute value. I mean, we absolute the whole column. So you can see that there is a whole whole column is a, with the absolute value. Of course, because the the stock price is uh, has to be uh, positive. So uh, this is just um, the same the results. But uh, it doesn't matter. I just want to show you how to use the absolute function, and then we can use the product functions to um, to just um, uh, part it for each of the elements right here. So that should be um, 52.7 multiply the 77.45 and then multiply this one, multiply this one, and so on. And we could have a 
cumulative products. That means um, 52.7 times this one, and then these two elements will then add up to these these three elements of the products of these three elements. And similarly, we can have have a sum uh, um, accumulated uh, sum. What is accumulated sum is that just um, these elements add these elements, and then these uh, these elements, uh, and then uh, I should say, let me let me show you. This is fifty point seven, and this is the first element, and then the second element is that fifty two point seven plus seven seven five, and then fifty point seven. Plus seven point four five plus forty three point nine and so and so and this is the uh, accumulated sum and then the accumulated uh, product that I just show you is the just change it to a multiplier and then so this is not so hard and that's it for this lesson thank you for your watching.